Our final awards of the, of the night are the True Blue President's Awards and will be presented by our President and First Lady. They're the highest honor that a student athlete can achieve at Middle Tennessee. These two awards really take everything into account, including success in their chosen sport, impeccable work in the classroom, and all the intangibles it takes to gain the distinction of being true blue. The two winners tonight embody the ideals that the university and that the NCAA hold closely, community service, academic success, and athletic prowess. In 2001, Dr. Sidney McPhee was appointed as the 10th president of MTSU. During Dr. McPhee's presidency, the university has witnessed considerable growth and progress and has gained national and international recognition. Student enrollment has increased significantly during his tenure and as a result, MTSU is the number one choice for undergraduates in Tennessee, the number one choice for Tennessee's veterans, the number one choice of transfer students in Tennessee, and the number one choice of summer school students. Over the past 11 years, under the leadership of Dr. McPhee, MTSU has been successful in raising admission standards, resulting in an increase in high ability students. Dr. McPhee's presidency also coincides with several major improvements in university facilities. During the past six years, the university has been engaged in capital projects, either proposed, under construction, or completed, totaling more than $400 million. President McPhee has received numerous honors from around the world and serves on several boards, including the NCAA Division I Board of Directors and its Executive Committee. Dr. McPhee is joined tonight by First Lady Elizabeth McPhee. Mrs. McPhee has been teaching in public schools for more than 30 years in four different states, including the Metropolitan Nashville-Davidson County Public Schools and the Murfreesboro City Schools. Liz has been married to Dr. McPhee for 30 plus years and they have two wonderful kids, Sydney Anthony McPhee and Seneca Ann McPhee. So please welcome your number one fans, folks, MTSU President Dr. Sydney and First Lady Ms. Elizabeth McPhee. Good evening. Liz and I, the First Lady of MTSU, are so pleased to be with you this evening. And what a fantastic crowd. I'm happy, we are happy that you all are here to experience this wonderful evening. I want to give special thanks to everyone who's been responsible for arranging, coordinating, and organizing this evening. Let's give our coordinators and the folks who are responsible for this evening a great round of applause. What a fantastic evening to be a Blue Raider. Now it's my pleasure to announce the true Blue President's Award to our female student athlete. The award goes to a young lady who epitomizes what it means to be a Blue Raider, a real, true student athlete. She has shown her prowess on the basketball court as well as her outstanding and exceptional academic performance in the classroom. Here are just a few of her accomplishments. An all Sun Belt first team selection for the second straight season, the 26th member of the school's 1,000 point club, but only the second to join by the end of the sophomore year. No other Blue Raider has scored more points through her sophomore season than this young lady. Named to the WBCA All Region 4 team, she's recorded 16 double doubles in 2011 2012, raising a career total to 32 in just two seasons. And she carries, ladies and gentlemen, a 3.7. GPA as a physics major. I'm proud to present, Liz and I are proud to present 
this true blue president's award to none other but Ebony Rowe. I just want to first off thank God for putting me at an amazing school like MTSU. <laughs> I want to thank all the amazing fans, my amazing coaches for pushing me every day on the court and in the classroom. <laughs> and some crazy girls sitting back there, I don't know who they are. <laughs> but my teammates, um, we've been through so much last year and everything that we've been through, these are like my sisters, I love y'all and this is all for y'all. Next, it's our pleasure and honor to present the male winner of the True Blue President's Award. This individual has done everything asked of him in the classroom. He has served as an ambassador for the university on the national stage and has been a team member on the men's golf team and has been an exceptional player on the course. Here are some of his accomplishments. As a freshman, he played in all seven events. He survived the three rounds of qualifying to become the first Blue Raider to qualify and play in the 2011 U.S. Open at the Congressional Country Club in Washington, D.C. He has had five top 20 finishes in tournaments in this is just his sophomore year. He is a two-time All Sun Belt selection. His community service work has included special kids and the AHEAD Foundation, among many. And he's never, never, ever made a B in college. He carries a perfect GPA of 4.0 and is majoring in business administration. Ladies and gentlemen, join the First Lady and I in welcome to the stage the winner of the True Blue President's Award, Brett Patterson. Uh, it's just a, an amazing honor. Um, first off, I have to thank my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for uh, displacing, <laughs> displacing so many opportunities in my life and just to be able to attend such a great school. Um, second, just to my teammates, uh, your support and your drive to make me better each and every day is uh, it's, it's priceless. And uh, to my parents for lugging me around all these many golf tournaments and always pushing me to be the best that I can be, it means a lot. And uh, to the big man, Coach Turnbo, for all you do, uh, it's, it's, it's an honor to be your, your, uh, your player on the golf team. So thank, thank you all. Appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> 